Hello, and welcome to all our data rock stars. I'm Anya Prasvetova, a Tableau visionary and data dev ambassador. I hope you're ready to hear about all the amazing highlights for the Tableau 2022.2 release. Here is an overview of what's coming out in this release. We have some major innovations and features sourced directly from our Tableau community, all designed to make data easier for everyone. My personal favorite is new functionality coming with Embedding API version 3.2, especially the Embedded Web Authoring function. Now, your customers are not only able to explore Tableau dashboards you embed in an app or a web page, but they can also edit them and add new data directly in the application or the web page. That will enable them to find more insights from their data in no time. Of course, this video is too short to cover all these amazing features. So let's look at some of the major updates that are coming up soon. I'm excited to announce Data Stories, Tableau's latest augmented innovation. Data Stories automate the analysis, build, and communication of insights, but it's fully customizable, so you can tailor the stories as needed. This feature breaks down your data by relevant dimensions and presents insights as bullet points that are easy to read and understand. Data Stories help any user confidently access, understand, and communicate with data. All it takes to get started is a drag and drop and three simple configuration steps. And if data stories aren't simple enough, you can now edit metrics so you can keep track of your most important data at a glance. You can now return to and edit existing metrics to change the historical comparison period, date range, and status indicators. What's more is that there is also a lightweight in metric date window. This allows you to quickly reveal more or less metric data without editing the configuration. Next up, we have enhancements that will change how you prepare your data. With additional attribute options, you now have the fine-grained control you need to programmatically input files. Use Wildcard Union to filter for a subset of files so you're always working with the right data. Additionally, Tableau Prep allows you to easily reorder columns by drag and dropping in the field list view. The order is then maintained across the entire flow and final output, so you can get oriented with your data quickly. Next, we have an exciting update for the Tableau Exchange. You're probably already familiar with the Exchange website, exchange.tableau.com, where you can find trusted offerings that help you jumpstart your analytics journey. Now, you can access the Exchange experience in all three offerings, extensions, connectors, and accelerators directly from Tableau Desktop. How great is that? Last but not least, we have autosave in the browser. I'm sure many of you had a situation when your dashboard changes were lost because your laptop ran out of battery before you clicked save. Tableau now supports autosave, so you can work with confidence knowing your edits are stored. Stay in the flow of analysis and resume your work exactly where you left off every time. As you make edits, they are automatically stored in an unpublished draft on the server. Once finished, you can publish the draft to commit your changes. This provides tight control over publishing, so you can work without fear of breaking things or disclosing content prematurely. That's it for today, and thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed these features, and if you want to learn more about this and any other new features coming in 2022.2, visit tableau.com.